Three different players scored in double figures in a loss against Lehigh last Saturday, and it would be the same three repeating that performance last night. One of those players was Josh Rivera, who would score eight of the Leopards' opening ten points as they led by five. Loyola would keep it a tight race with a couple of the team's six three-pointers before Lafayette went on a 14-0 run. Leo O'Boyle had eight points in the stretch, scoring two triples, while teammate T.J. Berger also knocked him back from the outside, all part of the team's eight trades. By the end of the first half, the Leopards had a comfortable 39-24 advantage. While the second half would start slow offensively, Lafayette would get back into a rhythm, further extending their lead. O'Boyle would be disruptive on defense, leading to an uncontested layup for two from C.J. Fulton. Kyle Jenkins would then connect from the perimeter for their largest lead of the night, 47-29. While Loyola would respond and cut the home team's lead to 11, Lafayette wasn't going anywhere with a 15-4 run to the finish line. Justin Vanderbon had eight points in that stretch that secured a win for the Leopards. Lafayette defeats Loyola 62-46. to Defense is going to help us win a lot of games in this league. Um, there's a lot of high scores, but not many teams want to bunker down and play defense for 40 minutes. So if we could keep this trend going and keep playing good defense, I think we can go a long road. Our coaches put together a great scout. So we knew what the other team's strengths were, what their weaknesses were, and we tried to force them into that all night. Um, everybody was ready down in the stands from the beginning of the game. We took away a lot of the, what they like to do. Lone senior Leo O'Boyle is averaging over 12 points per game, and his offensive success has contributed to what was the Leopards' fifth Patriot League win of this season. That was the fourth time O'Boyle has scored over 18 points this year, and the best part is he's one of three players on this team averaging in double figures. I mean, I have a lot of confidence in our system and our players that we're going to get me and each other the ball in the right place at the right time um, and we're confident in each other to make those shots and make the plays to help us win the game so I mean that was a display today if you couldn't tell but um, a lot of guys are playing well in the offense and it, it worked well. We talk about it a lot the guys on the team like anybody on our team can go for 20 some points any night so it's been good it's, it's hard for teams to scout us because they don't know who's going to have it that night. We're back on track again got a big one on Saturday at Colgate um, against the number one team in the league I, I think we'll be ready to go. In Easton I'm Gwen Begley for the Service Electric Network.